Hello, welcome back to Distant Worlds 2. Continuing our playthrough here as the Gazurians, and this is potentially the last episode in the campaign. All depends on how well this goes, as far as us attacking and defending against the uh, guys. Looks like our defense fleet is doing a number on a lot of their ships in general. Uh, why aren't you destroying them? You're jumping away, but why? They're easy targets. We have a lot of troops built up over here. Uh, let's take a look. Pretty sure they are investing heavily into trying to take back the Yitnis Junction. So my hope is that we can abuse the fact that they want to take that back. Because I feel like all these fleets up here were pushing down in that direction. But we'll see. I mean, they, they keep pivoting and changing, so. Yeah, see, these are all heading towards the Guinness Junction 5 mining station. We're all heading here, which is fine. Why I'm heavily constructing all of this stuff on these planets. Gravitic net, all this good stuff. Population is rebounding pretty nicely. I need to get some defense fleets over here, though. So if we can get... Even just one of these guys. Defense Fleet 1. I'm going to fly you over here. We'll leave you on automatic, but hopefully you actually head over there. You should. I mean, you're not that far away. 211 ships in that one fleet. That is crazy. Oh, fighters. Okay. That makes a little more sense. Uh, did we start building up defenses on this planet? I feel like we did. Yes, we did. All right, so I imagine we are actually building up some of these chips to attack these guys in orbit. Are we actually softening these guys up at all? You know what I didn't do? I did not um, double down on the military damage being done by the uh, bombard weapons. I was still using the Eclipse stuff. So part of me wants to invest a little more in this area here. Not so much the area of effect, although that's fine too. Uh, I do want to, right here, improve military damage. Might as well keep bumping up the growth here. All right, come on, you can do it. Now, are we actually destroying any of this stuff? Yeah, I feel like we're not doing, um, the 72 fighters is the capacity. Are we actually sending the fighters out? Maybe? I actually don't know. They can't escape, though. There's nowhere to go. You know what I kind of want to do? Build one of these. It'll probably get destroyed almost immediately, but... It'd be pretty funny if I get actually get this built. All right, how's this whole situation over here going? A lot of them are still funneling down here. Slowly but surely. The defense fleet show up yet? Short by name. Part of me does want to make a couple new defense fleets just because of how um, ridiculous this is going to be. All right. Anything with Yitness in the name is probably where we want to form this. Probably overlook it, but I'm going to try to find it. It should be Junction, so it should be one of the longer names. Let's form another defensive fleet. It was one of the longer names. What is this? This is Defense Fleet 8 and Defense Fleet 9, which, again, if we build any more, I'm going to have to uh, redo the naming so that they sort properly. All right, let's see where they are going and what they are doing. Hopefully, most of them end up over here. Are you actually going to try to invade this station? Or are you just going to blow it up? Looks like blow it up is the answer. Now, the question is, will they repath or will they still head down to there? Because that's where they were headed. They were moving to that mining station, but that mining station is now gone. Go ahead and keep uh, keep researching these techs. I wonder if any of this improves the uh, like cluster mines on the planet or anything. 
Probably not, but we could try. Oh boy. We I, I'm not doing population damage, I'm just doing military damage. The only thing I care about destroying. Pumping up the reactor energy. I don't think I really need to worry that much about the hyperdrive, but might as well just keep dumping points into it. Alright, have these guys recalculated? Eh, it still says they're moving there, even though it doesn't exist anymore. What are the rest of our invasion fleets doing? I feel like not much is going on with them. Let's head over here and uh, put our guys back on auto. Now, you were... See, like, what are you doing? You're not actually invading the planet. I mean, they're moving really quick, which is nice. But I gotta wait for all these... Uh, actual troop transports to get real close to the planet and then invade. All right, go ahead and attack. Imagine that that will be an invasion. Set you back on auto. See what you're doing. You were over over here probably doing the same thing. Ah, nice. They're actually blowing up uh, some of their invasion fleets as they're loading troops out of, out of the planet. Jumping blocks, so we probably will destroy them. Very nice. If we can get, if we can destroy these uh, troop transports, that would be awesome. Right, let's get over here if we can. Definitely want to take out the ones that have the troops on them. There we go. Come on. Take this one out next. It's just more troops that can never hit our planets. All right, what was that? Invasion Fleet 8? Let's uh, hop back over there. Build that stuff up. We'll go back to 10. All right, come on. I know you can destroy it. You can do it. Or it gets away. Come on. There we go. Very nice. All right, let's bombard the planet. Give a wipe out the rest of the troops. Soften everything up a little bit before we actually invade. Okay, we're definitely damaging them. Check out this other invasion fleet. It's flying around doing something. Probably the same thing. Mm, this actually has a bunch of stuff. All right, we're going to manually control these and try to go blow all these stations up. And then we'll bombard the heck out of this planet. Uh, speaking of which, might as well get our bombard fleet over here. I don't know what happened to some of these invasion fleets. They got pretty beat up. Pick up these defensive batteries while we can. Hopefully our fleets get over here to bombard the heck out of these, because there's no way we're invading this planet. Oh, Admiral Rivalry. Let's see what we got. Sort by name, we're looking at Dashak and Shindu. So this guy, which only has demoralizing, but that slowly... Oh, that's terrible. It decreases the skills. Okay, he's gone. I don't even care what Shindu has, but I'm going to look anyway. I mean... That's fine. Go attack the space. I'm gonna keep attacking the bases. What the heck's going on with this thing? It's like whirling around in a circle. Right, did the bombard fleets finally show up? Looks like they did. Gonna take out all these defense batteries while we're bombarding this planet. But hopefully it'll be ready to invade by the time we whittle it down enough. We must be doing at least a little bit of troop damage. Now, Invasion Fleet 6 was the one we had over by our planet. But we are going to go ahead and put this back on automatic. The hope is that it will refill itself. 
where are the defensive fleets that we hold to come over here? Okay, they decided to rehome themselves somewhere else. And I, to be fair, I do have the AI set to do that. But still, these guys are like, they don't know what to do. They're trying to move to a mining station that we destroyed. And they are, uh, they're lost. They don't know what to do. Head back over here. How's this going? Let's go ahead and just actually invade the planet now. Do a little scour action. Go ahead and we're going to put you back on automatic. Let you do whatever you need to do. Now you're over here trying to destroy this all these bases. Somebody else is bombarding the heck out of the colony. Still don't feel like they're quite getting in there as well as they could. Let's move everybody forward a, just a little bit. Bombard that. Now the invasion fleet can join in on the fun. Oh, one of our colonies has been invaded. Uh, I'm not worried about that right now. I feel like we have plenty of defense, at least for now. See how this bombardment's going with everything firing on it at the same time? Yeah, we're actually doing a decent amount of damage now. We're just seeing entire troops being deleted. Perfect. I'm hoping some of these uh, defensive buildings are also getting knocked down. Looks like they're getting built in. almost as quick as they're getting knocked down. Oh man, there's a lot of a lot of troops on these planets, and a lot of ships coming after us. Or right, those are ours. Never mind. We're fine. I don't know why we'd try to invade with just like single troops there. Let's blow up this stuff first. All right, you have not even destroyed the planetary shield yet. Definitely whittled down some of the troops though. Gonna keep going. Hey, you got 24,000 troops on you still. I imagine once we destroy the spaceport, we can bombard the um, planet. I'd be fine. We'll destroy this. We'll destroy the other thing. Then we'll go after the planet. What what is invading? I'm not telling them to invade. They're on manual. All right, we can bombard this planet now. Hopefully wipe out some of these groups. Open them up a little bit. Come back over to Bartuck. Like we have destroyed their shields. So I imagine the rest of it should fall relatively quick. We're starting to actually damage the population now. The rest of these buildings should fall relatively soon. Being blocked, I imagine we're gonna destroy most of these. Right, we'll try not to destroy this planet, but we will soften it up as much as we can. Just about softened up to the point where we can invade. There we go. Right. Don't need to destroy any more. Go ahead and stop that. Go ahead and stop that. And actually, just have you start attacking. There we go. Should be able to take that planet with very little issue. Go ahead and build up this stuff. Invasion Fleet 13, we're gonna set you back on automatic invasion. We got the same thing going on over here to a lesser extent. We'll just have to knock knock this down to almost nothing as well. To be able to attack now. I think they're trying to invade with just a couple little ships, which is interesting. How this is not getting destroyed immediately, I I don't know. 
All right, the scouring has been done. Let's go ahead and continue to build this stuff up. Let you back on auto invade. All right, let's see what you guys are up to now. Trying to find your way to a planet, it looks like. All right. Have they moved at all? Not really. Some of them have. You're loading troops. You're loading troops. Not really invading, though. You do have a full contingent of troops, but you only have one ship, so... Can't be that bad. There's just like a string of enemy ships along here. I wonder if I build up some more facilities, if we can do a little more damage to them. Just start blowing up all these ships that are passing by. Oh, you know what? I never checked. I was building something down here? Or down here? I don't think I actually built... I went to go build a spaceport, I think. Must not have survived, at least not initially. Although now we have a defense fleet over here messing around. Maybe there's a chance now. Ah, over here we actually have a spaceport, so I don't think we have to worry too much about that. Uh, they're invading Bartok. I mean, you want to waste your troops? Go for it. Again, I don't know how this strong of an army hasn't wiped out these four enemy military blocks. All right, let's go. Stop up with uh, ships. Still got some troops over here doing some stuff. Oh my goodness, no wonder why you're not invading. They're all just way too powerful. Well, let's just try to bombard the heck out of them. Alright, let's try to destroy that spaceport if we can. Once that's gone, we'll have much less to worry about in this system. Wow, there's a lot of troops there. If we can destroy the spaceport, we might be able to destroy these fleets before they can hop away. There's a ton of troops on these fleets. Let's fly over here. Well, that seemed a little silly. Right, let's get everybody really close to this planet. I guess I'm just blowing these things up. Which is fantastic because that's a ton of troops. Every one of these transports has a bunch of demolition forces. Up. Right, where's our bombard fleets? And where is this system anyway? Is it even anywhere close? Nope. All the way over here. I wonder why we're making no progress. This is perfect. Don't have to fight him on the ground if I blow him up in space. Although we seem to be getting our butts kicked over here. I don't even understand how. They have two troops over here. It right, looks like we are taking this planet. Alright, let's bombard this planet. Should be able to wipe out some of these troops. Go check out how we're doing over here. Can't be that good if the shield's still up. No, it doesn't look like we made much of a dent at all over here yet. Try to get some of our bombard fleets up here. Come over here. Scour this colony. Take this one back. Alright, this one's a lot weaker. Has a lot less troops. We should be able to soften this one up pretty quickly. Yep. Yep. Go. All right, let's swap that to an attack. Did win this one pretty handily, I would think. And where's this at? Also, kind of in the center of their systems there. I feel like we didn't really do a great job of coming in over on that side where we wanted to. The AI just kind of flung us back to where we were. Hop back over here. I do have my bombard fleets heading over this way. I imagine this is going to be another planet we might actually end up destroying on accident. Or on purpose, one of the two. But anywhere we can knock out a ton of troops. We've destroyed 3,300 troops of theirs. Pretty, pretty nuts. 
I wish we would start re uh refueling our, our troops. I feel like that's not happening. The invasion fleets are just uh kind of petering off. I'm gonna set them down here. You know what? You you are probably fine to do what you were doing. Go attack this spaceport. You guys just are not making progress. Right, why don't you come over here? All right, we repulsed some of their invaders, which is good. Open to take this planet. Looks like we're going to be doing that now. And that was without these guys even joining the fight. Where's the next spot over here? Yeah, why don't you just come over here and start trying to take this planet? Oh, did you guys actually take that spaceport out? Did. Geeky buggers. All right, let's bombard this settlement then. Scour this colony. Build this stuff back up. Uh, you were bombarding a big old planet. Go over there. Field's still up, so it can't be too bad. Nope. We've very slightly whittled down from like 152 to 158. I'm hoping once the bombard fleets get here, we'll be in a little better shape. Scour this colony now. Build gravity wells everywhere. Just slow them down wherever they're at. All right, you were moving to the next system over, I think. Yes. Some of these guys were moving back to our home or systems here to try to get them to refuel or not refuel, but repopulate their uh, troop transports with groups. As of right now, they've done nothing. Where are these bombard fleets? I know I instructed them to come up here and bombard Athoria. Are you actually over here? Some of you are. Still have not made a lot of progress over there. All right, well, we've definitely uh, made a mess of anything coming through this area. Between everything I built up on this planet and this uh, spaceport over here with the interceptors and the bombers, we are just anything that flies by. We're just immediately annihilating you know what I should do. I, I don't think I'm building them, but I should build some uh, defense platforms. I do have a defense platform template, don't I? I do. Apparently we still need all these reactors. I'm kind of shocked to see that. All right, let's look at weapons. I think we can get some, uh, some of those rail guns on here. They've got to be the right kind. Uh, we can go ahead and build at least one quantum shard. I'm trying to remember what that thing was called. It wasn't the phased beam array, was it? No. Forge rail battery. That's what I'm looking for. But that would be a large. I want a medium. Wow, we've used up the size already. We're definitely going to switch out all this stellar armor. Matter of fact, I think we could probably use one less. And that would cover the size. Go ahead and build that. There we go. Let's just build a bunch of defense bases. Sure, that won't be ridiculous. I mean, we got the money. What does it matter? All right, are they still trying to come down here, or what are they doing? Can't tell. Oh, that's a lot of dead generals. I don't know where they died. That could not have been pleasant. All right, we still have not gotten enough people over there to fully soften that up. They got a lot of troops just sitting on some of these planets. Hoping I could wipe a lot of them out. Flip up a couple bastions here. That'll start wiping some of those guys out. All right. I'm not too surprised we held them at bay. Come on. I think all we got to do is take a couple more systems. Might take forever for these to actually get built. But I'm more of doing it because it's funny. They have a bunch of those uh, blocking everything all the time. All right, let's take a look at our invasion fleets. You're not quite down here yet. You are bombarding a planet. Where are you? You're up here. Imagine you're trying to go somewhere. Nope. Let's come down here. All right, invasion fleet five is over here. Let's mark you to invade. Hopefully you'll load troops. That's kind of the goal of why I'm having you come down here. 
Agent Fleet 7's somewhere stuck in the middle here. Where's 8? Eight? 8's stuck over here as well. I think we told it to come over here. Just never actually made it over here. Why have you not made it over here? There you go. Now you're going. Right, we'll bombard that planet as well. Although I imagine this one's going to be a little bit easier to soften up and take the troops out of. Yeah, like we've already destroyed most of them. Okay, bud. It is time to go. I can actually invade this planet now. More than I could say for these guys. They're not even close to getting over there yet. All right, they're still trying to get troops off of this planet. The only good thing is that I'm blowing them up as they're loading them up. All right, so invasion fleet, whatever. You're just trying to, trying to make your way through. You are down here, I think, at this point. Holy cow. You've been annihilated. Wait, did they take back this planet? No. Maybe? No, Yitness Junction's up here. Okay. They did not take this back. All right, we're going to put you back on auto. See what you managed to cook up while you're over there. Are you guys near the edge of a spot over here. Not quite there, though. There's nothing over here. All right, attack Fleet 9. There's no reason you should be buzzing away from there. Definitely want to attack all these guys loading up troops. I mean, why wouldn't you? All right, we are actually destroying the uh, infrastructure now and the planetary population. But I imagine we're actually going to blow up the uh, or kill all the pops before we destroy all the buildings and the um, troops. There's just too much. All right, scour that colony. Build what we can over here. We head back over to where we are here. Now, we have 35k troops on these ships. I'm guessing we're not going to be able to knock this down low enough to be able to invade with that, but we'll see. We'll try. Right, let's see if we can get this bombard fleet a little closer. And maybe I'll soften them up enough. I, I do not have a lot of confidence. Now, how could they possibly have space control? Was it because a single ship came into the system? I'll take this down to like 2 million and then I'll try to invade. But we'll, I don't know. We'll see. We'll see where the defense strength is at by then. Because I will get bonuses when I attack between the generals and everything else. Space, controlling space. They don't actually have any defensive facilities. I don't know why it's giving them credits for that. All right, they're pretty much down to where we are. I gotta leave at least enough uh, population to be able to do something here. Looks like we got some more people joining. Getting close to the limit. Don't wanna go too much lower than this.
All right, that's probably good. We go ahead and highlight this bombard fleet. Tell them to stop. Highlight this bombard fleet. Tell them to stop. And then we just got the invasion fleet, who is, you know, roughly the same power. We'll let them hit a couple more times. All right, 20k. We probably got that. Go ahead and attack. Oh, yeah. That's definitely swinging in our direction now. See, that's the advantage of softening them up. They just get destroyed so easily once you actually invade. All right, scour that colony. Go ahead and rebuild all this stuff. Put you back on auto. All right, what are you doing? Looks like we're about to do the same thing over here. Oh, we got an attack fleet over here too, though. All right, well, let's dogpile on this thing and just bombard the heck out of it. All right, I got to imagine this is going to be pretty quick with two giant fleets bombarding it. We haven't even damaged the actual population yet. Now we have. Holy cow. Note to self, do not make them angry. All right, go ahead and attack this planet. Definitely taking that without much of a problem. All right, we'll set that on automatic. The problem with automatic, I feel like they just ignore the fact that they have to scoop troops up. They just stop trying to even repopulate the their capacity. Like, I would love to keep invading this area over here. Oh, we're out of Hexadorium over here. All right, well, what can we do here? with these invasion fleets that are doing very little. Uh, it would certainly be nice to build up a couple defensive bastions over here. All right, so invasion fleet two. You would think while you're here, oh, you want to jump all over the dang place. Why don't you load up some troops? Crazy idea. I'm just going to manually load these. All right, well, we have a lot of troops over here. Yeah, you should be able to load up pretty significantly over there. Maybe if I find just some big reservoirs of troops and I tell them to load. I always flip them back to uh, automatic afterwards. All right, so what are you doing over here? That should max you out on troops. Which is perfect because then we can start pushing into these areas over here. Where's the old bombard fleets? We're just going to bombard every one of these planets. What did we try to do? We just have a random fleet with some troops on it. Or not even a fleet, just a random troop ship. All right, now you got a decent chunk of troops on you. Let's get everybody down here first and attack all at the same time. What a novel concept. All right, pretty sure everybody's down here now. Or at least mostly down here. All right, if you attack all at the same time, your chances of victory are much higher. You know, it sounds crazy, but really it's true, I swear. Do we have more troops, I hope? We certainly have a lot more in the fleet. There we go. I think we're working our way over here. All right. Oh, hey, look at that. We got ourselves a victory. Doing a little bit of invading there, and we hit the 70% threshold, so we have one. The Hespis Junction Guild is down to 40%. And it looks like taking over the colony of Ingo was the thing that uh, tipped me over the edge there. So I imagine we could keep going forever but and eventually wipe them out entirely. But we don't need to. We only needed to take what we needed there to get the victory. And this concludes the Gazurian playthrough. Perfect. So I... Looking back on the uh, the way this went, I at the very beginning, I was unsure if we would ever be able to come back from where we were. We were not in a good spot. We had been uh, attacked twice by the Deut. We were knocked down to one of the smaller systems, or the smaller uh, empires in general. Uh, but we managed to, you know, claw our way back. Just continually going around attacking the weakest people and then eventually pushing to attack somebody that's a little bit larger while they were distracted and engaged in another war. 
So that uh, that ended up paying off pretty big. I'm glad that actually worked out really well. Uh, and then kind of from there, we just snowballed and eventually took over all this area, consolidated our territory, then pushed over here, took over all of the, the Deut as well, as well as the um, the uh, Telosians and um, one other group as well. We're all kind of the same orange color, so we ended up just taking over everybody that was orange. And then to finish off, we just pushed and, uh, and took over as much of the Hespis Junction Guild as we needed to to win. So, thank you for watching. If you liked the video and liked the series, subscribe. There will be more content in the future. And thank you for watching.